Happy New Year. This is my first video of 2013. I'm off for the next two days, so I just had to get some videos out there to you guys. Hope everybody's doing good. I hope everybody was safe and made it through the New Year. It's crazy. It's already 2013 and the fuckery has just begun. So I'm sure you guys have been keeping up or maybe you guys haven't, but they finally came to some type of agreement with the fiscal cliff. And, you know, it's all a bunch of nonsense to me. But what I find funny is that this is not top news all over, you know, the big sites. The main news is Kim and Kanye, Kim and Kanye, Kim Kardashian is pregnant. This is the main top story all over the internet, not the fiscal cliff. The fiscal cliff has come a close second, but it's not first. So anyways, I'm sure you guys have all heard by now that Kim and Kanye are expecting a baby. Kanye decided to stop his concert in Atlantic City to tell everybody the following news. I'm going to go ahead and play the clip for you guys right now. Can you make some noise for my baby mama right quick, right? I played from that one, right? I did write this one. Okay, you guys just watched the clip, and Kanye is so fucking arrogant, and he's just, he's a hood booger with money. You know, Kanye was truly on his hood booger shit that night. How you gonna stop a concert and say, yo, make some noise for my baby mama? I'ma need Kanye West to do a little bit better than that. So anyways, you would think she'd be offended by the way, you know, he announced her birth, but no, not Kim. You know, she's an attention whore. She took right to Twitter as soon as he made that announcement and was like, yup, me and Kanye are excited. We're expecting a baby. Here goes her tweet. So the media is currently reporting that Kim Kardashian is three months pregnant, which I find funny because she's only been technically with Kanye for six months. So she got pregnant within the first three months of them being official. What's also funny is that she's still married to Chris, the man that she married for 72 days, Chris Humphreys. So this whole situation, if this isn't trailer park trash, I don't know what this is. But, you know, I guess because it's Kim Kardashian and Kanye, you know, I guess everybody's just going to breeze over that. The fact that she's still married and the fact that she got pregnant by somebody within three months. If that was anybody else, they'd be all types of chicken heads and hood rats. But not Kim. She's a celebrity. She's beautiful with a fat ass, so, you know, you can't knock her. With that being said, I also find it funny that Reggie Bush and his Kim Kardashian lookalike, they have a baby on the way. And Kanye's ex-girlfriend, Amber Rose, as we all know, she's pregnant and she's about to give birth any day now to Wiz Khalifa's baby. So I find it funny that both of their exes are with other people and they're both expecting children and now Kanye and Kim are now expecting a child as well. You know, it's like, could this not be planned any more perfectly? I definitely feel like they did this for attention, but again, they're grown. They're both over the age of 30 and they both can afford to take care of their child. But the point is, I just know for a fact that this is going to be all over the media. We're going to be hearing about Kim for the next nine months. We're going to be hearing about her morning sickness, how fat her ass is getting. We're going to be hearing about Kim and Kanye nonstop. This is what attention whore is like. And I just know her pregnancy, the delivery, everything is going to be featured on the E! Network. It's going to be on the show Keeping Up With The Kardashians. I'm sure as soon as the baby is born, they'll have his contract right in their hand, ready for the child to sign his contract. <laughs> You know, but what's going to be so funny, like I said on Facebook, you cannot tell me Kanye's arrogant ass is not going to interrupt Kim while she's having that baby. I can just see Kanye saying, I'm sorry, Kim, but Beyonce had the best birth of all time. Because we know how much Kanye dick rides Jay-Z and Beyonce. So I can just see Kanye saying some mess like that. But anyways, I guess, congratulations to the power couple. You know, that's what they're being called, and I thought Obama and Michelle were power couples, but I guess I'm wrong. Um, you know, Kanye and Kim Kardashian are power couples. So, you know, I guess the congratulations is in order, you know, but this is going to be really funny to see how this plays out. So go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know what you guys think about the entire pregnancy. And how do you feel about this pregnancy getting more attention, more national headline, more news than the fiscal cliff decision? I just find that super ironic. But again, I'm not shocked because we're more interested in celebrities in this society than we are in the fiscal cliff. I think some people think this fiscal cliff is some type of, you know, joyride at Six Flags. Who knows? But go ahead and leave a comment. All right. Deuces.